Hello folks and welcome back to the channel. Well, it's 2021 guys and I'm so glad 2020 is over. I'm back with you with another mod drop. This time on a much better computer so the video quality is much better. This mod isn't new per se. I rebuilt an older mod which I made. The Valhalla Armor and Weapons was fairly popular while they were up on the Nexus and Xbox. But with the cancel culture lunatics trying to run me out of the modding scene, those postings are long gone, especially from S Xbox. By popular demand, I rebuilt this mod. So let's get into it by rolling this sweet ass new intro. I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. I know what you're thinking. What is the difference between this version and the older one? Funny you should ask. When you enter a city, town, or anywhere where the courier can find you, that snarky little bastard is going to run up to you. He has a letter to you from me personally. Do what it says in the letter to find the book to be able to craft the armor and weapons out in the forge. Unless you got the mod add item menu, you absolutely will have to have the book. It is a requirement. So, the letter says we have to go out to Swindler's Den because those piece of shit bandits have stolen the book. Depending on what level your character is and how far you've progressed in the game, this could be easy or it could be fairly hard. Once you have killed the bandits guarding the entrance to Swindler's Den, head on inside. Of course, you're going to have to clear out the whole entire cave complex. Once you have wrecked those dirty bandits, you will find the book on a barrel next to the boss chest. That's it. That's all you have to do. Now head over to the forge and craft the armor and weapons. You're going to need some steel ingots, leather, and leather strips. Also, you're going to need a few ebony ingots as the weapons are slightly better than ebony. Actually, way better as they are so blindingly fast. But we will get into that in a minute. But let's take a look at the armor. The female version is CBBE curvy by default. For those of you on PC, I have body slide files to change this to whatever body type floats your boat. With the exception of UMP because fuck UMP. It doesn't work with body slide anyway. It is physics enabled so if you are into that jiggle you will get it with this mod. The armor is slightly better than steel armor and can be improved on the workbench. I found that it is also compatible with frostfall as well. Now, I said we would talk about weapons. When I said faster than vanilla weapons, I meant that shit. Both the sword and the great sword swing three times faster than vanilla weapons. Depending on how well you improve them, you can cut through the bad guys fairly quickly. The bow itself is also faster than a vanilla bow, so you can turn your targets into pincushions easily. Okay guys, that's it for this video. If you guys enjoy the mod, don't forget to endorse it. If you guys want to support the work of the Mighty Nine to continue to bring you high quality mods, smash that join button below the video or look in the description for links to the PayPal and the merch store. This mod is available for PC only on Shaken Mods because fuck the Nexus. It is also available for Xbox as well. The links to the mod pages are in the descriptions. Okay, guys, that's all I got. Until next time, remember, keep your sword sharp, don't be a milk drinker, and always watch the skies, traveler.